Dermatology uh, basically is a practice of medicine that deals with musculoskeletal diseases and connective tissue diseases. We also treat pain syndromes, medical orthopedic problems, and uh, a variety of connective tissue and musculoskeletal problems as they come up. Well, I think rheumatology is finally becoming an exciting practice of medicine as we have a lot of new opportunities, new agents and new techniques to use for the treatment of musculoskeletal problems that weren't available 10 or 15 years ago. And we have really been able to turn around a lot of conditions and keep people functional, keep them happy and healthy even though they have these uh, disease processes. There are um, biologic agents which have come to the market about 15 years ago, drugs like you see on TV, Embrel, Umira, um, Remicade, Zelgens, and they work to actually prevent the progression of the disease process, not just stop it which at where it is, which is very important for taking care of a patient with this kind of process. Many of these agents are given by IV infusion. Some are given subcutaneously. We train the patients to give their own injections, most come in a pen, so it's very easy to do. We also treat uh, fibromyalgia patients, and we do a micronutrient infusion therapy called Myers Cocktail which I have been pleased myself to see just how effective it is at reducing pain and fatigue in the patients. And we do that routinely in the office. Can also provide local corticosteroid injection therapies and other injection therapies, which can work dramatic results uh, quite effectively and efficiently. The patient can actually walk out of here feeling much better than they came in. And that's something that is very nice to have in a multi-specialty and internal medicine practice because people can actually see Dr. Lo Cicero or one of the nurse practitioners and come and have the injection for their gout or their acute flare of arthritis and leave much better than they came in. Um, I specialize in rheumatology. I work with collaboration with Dr. Kramer here. Uh, we manage a variety of conditions such as lupus, uh, different types of arthritis such as rheumatoid arthritis, osteoarthritis, psoriatic arthritis. We treat different types of joint pain such as back pain, knee pain, elbow pain, carpal tunnel syndrome, gout, um, pain and fatigue conditions such as fibromyalgia. Um, well, there's a variety of different ways we have medications and some of them require close monitoring, which is nice because we do have a lab in office, and so we're able to get the results quickly and act on the results if needed. We also have an infusion suite for which we can give different medications for. We can give infusions for lupus patients. We can give infusions for osteoporosis patients. We can give infusions for different types of arthritis patients. We have a lot of patients who respond uh, with improvements in fatigue, and then also some patients, such as our fibromyalgia patients, experience a reduction in their pain with the infusions. We do um, a medication called Reclast infusion that prevents and also treats osteoporosis. It's a once a year infusion. We also have medications, several different types of infusions for arthritis. Um, we have one called Orincia that we prescribe. We also have um, one, a new one that just came out called Symponi. Working in a multi-specialty is great for both providers and patients. Um, in rheumatological issues, a lot of conditions affect different parts, different organs of your body, and to be able to just refer your patient to your um, coworker increases the communication and increases the comprehensive care of your patient. You're able to review their labs, their records, so everyone's on the same page, so you have optimal care for your patient. And it's easier for patients too. They have less paperwork they have to fill out and they know that all their doctors are on the same page. And then another um, great feature about this medical clinic is that we do offer bone densities in office and you can even have your bone density done the same day as your follow-up appointment. So it's easier for you and it's quicker diagnostic and treatment for the patient. Our lab here is wonderful and with rheumatology we have a lot of specialized testing and sometimes patients when they go to outside labs uh, some of the labs get missed or the lab techs will put in the wrong labs. We hear they're all familiar with what we need and what we order, so the patient is having less um, redraws, resticks, 
and if they do have a critical value, we're able to address it quicker with them. Uh, something that I bring to the table is that I have family members and close friends who have rheumatological issues, so I've seen their struggles and I've seen what helps them and what makes them worse and what they're looking for in a provider. And I do tend to get really attached to my patients and I do care and their best being is what I'm, my whole goal is.